mornings all and a very cold morning to us and uh, I say that what uh, one of the things I was actually going to do was I was actually going to do a uh, oh, myself over there. I was actually going to do um, uh, it was two days same location uh, but typical British weather changed it's now minus seven this morning. Oh, I must be flipping mad. However, I think instead I'm going to talk a little bit about being prepared when you do go out, especially if you're going on long hikes, of just a few things to be a bit cautious about and to think about. So, uh, let me get to location. Oh, and I think today's going to be a nice one. I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain Some things are not the same as they were a year ago But all will be okay, I move on each and every day The past is where it stays, way back a year ago I've changed for the better this time Well, I'm here. Oh, it's a shawl. Hold on a minute, let me just uh, zip that away. There we go. Thank God for shawl on this. I say that every time I know, but this is a bit dark. Mm. Yeah, not so sure on this one. Really not. Uh, I don't know. Might come up with something. If not, I've got to move quick. <laughs> Let's get set up anyway. Well, <clears throat> okay. It's actually not as bad as a uh, thought. It's just minus seven. It's uh, eight too bad. There's no breeze, so that's probably going to help. Um, this one's not spectacular. Um, but we've got the old pier running from the left and obviously we've got houses and stuff that are just on, on the right hand side just near the pebble bit old bell tower bit of history behind that and then we've got obviously we've got the blue sea which is looking really nice quite calm so it's going to yeah. and then we've got obviously as the sun's rising we've got some oranges and some purples and then back into the blues I don't know, it's just, it just looks really calming. So, yeah, it really does. Um, settings wise, we were uh, in manual, uh, ISO 100, uh, F14, and it's a quarter of a second. today really nice one of my favorites so being prepared when you're actually going to go out especially if you're going to walk and hike long distances it's really important that you your, your planning is really key here and even when I stay pretty local um, I always let my partner know where I'm going the route I'm taking and when I'm going to be back always make sure that I have a spare battery pack with me mobile phone obvious reasons first aid kit you never know when you're gonna need it it's only a small one um, it's just got these little plasters and stuff in it and it's nothing major you know. um, and a torch especially if you're going out sunrise or sunset torch is really handy to see where you're walking um, I always carry a spare one even though on my uh, frame here that obviously are used for re recording here. I've got a light in that on here as well. I always carry a spare one as well. And uh, money, really key. You could be out somewhere, it could be freezing cold, 
and even though you've took some supplies with you, some heat, you know, not a hot cup of tea or something like this, it's always handy to take a bit of change with you because you never know, you might need to buy something as well. So always take a bit of money with you. But it is real key that you do let somebody know where you are, where you're going. Um, well, one of the things that we do have uh, as well, my family, we've got a, 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 an app, not sponsored, not, this is not sponsored, is uh, Life360. Basically, uh, some people are probably a bit wary about this sort of a thing. It tracks where we're going and it gives a live indication of where we are. Um, now, I like it because if I am going for a, a long walk and a video shoot or something like that, everybody knows where I am. So if I do get into trouble or injured or something, I don't even have to tell them where I am. They literally can tell by the app. Um, I've also got an app on my phone as well, which is What Three Words, which is very handy because if you are out and about, you do get in touch with emergency services, you can give them three words and they can pinpoint your location to literally a metre squared. So there are a few things that you can do to make yourself safe, but also if something does happen, to be found quickly and easy. So yeah, real plan where, you, where you're going, especially with the British weather. It's like I said earlier, is that you know you, you you could be out one minute and the weather can change so much. And I mean today when I actually plan to do come to this actually location to to do two different day shooting because the mornings were going to be different. Um, what obviously it was going to be like today and tomorrow the cloud cover was supposed to be a little bit more, but now the weather's changed and it's going to be raining. Yeah, you know me and rain. I don't do rain. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I thought, right, okay, let me just move things about a bit. And I'm actually going to take a, a, probably about three or four, not moving, not changing any settings, as that sun rises. And then I can pick the nicest one that I like. Which is what I do quite regularly, really. Um, <clears throat> I don't go snap happy away and just shoot, 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 shoot for the sake of it. Because if things aren't changing, it's totally pointless. But with this, the colours are changing, the light is changing. Yeah, you get some different visuals just from that one point. <clears throat> Worth doing. What sort of things do you take out on you when you go on a shoot? Do you just take your camera equipment and that's it? Or I think I sort of may sometimes go probably a little bit over the top with, uh, <laughs> with what I take with me. But this is why I chose the bag that I did because I've obviously got the, the compartment for all the camera stuff. And I've got the butter compartment, which has got inserts and stuff that I can put in to put more camera equipment in or I can take those out I can put things in there you know drinks and stuff which is you know when I do go for long walks and stuff that's what I do do in there yeah I know it's a bit of extra weight but especially when you're going in the middle of nowhere you know you always be safe when you're going out especially with lots over the British weather oh, that's changing really nice over there you know what let's take another one let's have a quick look at that's because obviously as the sun is rising the um the exposure time is going to change um, so now we've gone from a quarter of a second and we are now on a fifteenth of a second so when you're doing sunrises keep an eye on your meter here as well is because the, 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 the sea is quite still I haven't got to worry of when doing like a pano of trying to make sure that the waves line up when you're doing the shot I'll go over that one day of um, <clears throat> a good method because um, it all depends on the way that you shoot each shot so if you go from left to right they're not going to line up if you go from right to left they they marry up a little bit better um, obviously depending on the angle where you're shooting I'm gonna go over that one day that's uh, it's on the cards that one <clears throat> and uh, yeah I'll well, probably gonna do a pano in a minute it is definitely to have that cup of tea uh, thanks for joining me it's a very short quick adventure talking about the weather a few bits probably I'm gonna do at home which uh, we're meaning to do and uh, yeah Okay, cracking on those I think this is warm thanks for joining me on this one guys and uh, I'll see you on the next one take care stay safe and I'll see you soon this time. I thought I would never be fine
I strive just to say I'm alright And for the first time in a long time I'm alright I've seen a lot of change Been through a lot of pain Some things are not the same As they were a year ago But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago. Oh, 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 oh. 